The classic 8-bit chime from our favorite retro video game finally makes a triumphant comeback as Mario Question Block Necklace. In this DIY project, we're going to show you how to build Mario Coin Sound Jewelry so you can wear it and learn about electronics and 3D printing. You can get the parts to build this project on the shop at Adafruit.com. The Adafruit Trinket Mini is a tiny microcontroller designed for small projects. And combined with the LiPo backpack, you can keep your projects enclosed while being able to recharge the circuit. We'll need to add a slide switch to easily power it on and off by prepping the LiPo backpack for wiring. We like using 30 gauge silicone coated stranded wires for those flexible connections. A fast vibration switch is crafted and shaped to fit nicely onto the trinket using flat pliers. Next up, we'll need to solder the leads to the JSD pads on the bottom of the trinket. We'll use tweezers and line up the wiring of the LiPo backpack so it can fit on top of the trinket. If you do want to build one yourself, of course follow along with the circuit diagram and full tutorial for this project on the Adafruit Learning System. The link is in the description. Next up, we'll wire up the LED sequin to make this project light up when the coin chimes by connecting the LED to the trinket. You can download the STLs for making these parts on your 3D printer, or if you don't own a 3D printer, you can always use a 3D printing service. The three-piece enclosure is designed to print with no support material and just snap fits together. We recommend using transparent filament to diffuse the light from the LED. Proceed by routing the wires from the piezo through the enclosure. We're going to mount this piezo to the back of the enclosure by securing it with the number 256 machine screw. Next up, we'll coil the excess wiring into the enclosure and carefully position the circuit. We'll go ahead and secure the circuit to the enclosure with another machine screw. Proceed by inserting the slide switch into the cutout with clips using tweezers and snap it into place. Last but not least, pop on the cover on top and press it to snap it into place. And now we have Mario Coin Sound Jewelry. What retro video game inspired jewelry would you make? You can let us know in the comments below and on our show and tell on Google+. Thanks so much for watching and check out our previous videos for more project ideas. And don't forget to subscribe for more projects from Adafruit.